We've been given another glimpse today of the New Look America's Cup with the AC-45 catamaran sailing together as a fleet for the first time. Martin Tarsko reports. Five AC-45s are now in the water, four of them lining up as a fleet today. Team New Zealand missing the fun with work being done on their boat. And fun it was, the crews watching and learning from each other and finding out how hard the racing is going to be. It's going to be very physical. I mean, the guys, uh, I mean, uh, after a few manoeuvres, they can hardly talk, you know. And I think that's great. That's just what the sport needs. It's also going to be very, very fast. With 10 to 15 knots of breeze today, the cats moved effortlessly up into the 20s through a choppy sea. Tough to keep up on a chase boat. I've been watching multis converging on the race course for years, but the speed that these multis come together is quite frightening, as would be the carnage if they got it wrong. The consequences of a carbon fibre collision not lost on the crews. You're going to have to be, obviously, faster reactions, but also, yeah, aware of that safety side. Um, I think everyone is. You just go onto the ribs and you see all the, the increase in quality of the first aid kit and you realise that, you know, you've got to bear it in mind, give it a little bit of thought. And new high-tech TV coverage due to be tested here next month will ensure no crunch goes unseen or unheard. What will make part of it exciting is that you're going to hear the adrenaline going on the boat. And so it should probably, you know, it's going to provide for some really good sound bites, I would suspect, for you at One News. And uh, it's going to... Uh, you know, provide a lot of entertainment for pretty much everybody involved, spectators and sailors alike. Close encounters, clearly the key. Martitasca, One News. Yes, and some great fast racing in store. That's it for sport today. Thanks very much, Andrew.